Hey guys, Bryce Off here. Welcome back to DuckTales Remastered. Today we're moving on to the Himalayas. And I am looking forward to this just to see how nasty it's going to be. I'm expecting that abominable snowman fight to be ridiculous. No, I don't want to travel there. I just picked it for fun. Pack my parka, Duckworth. We're headed for the Himalayas to hunt for the lost clone of Genghis Khan. Ooh, shall I forward your call, sir? Gee, can I come, Uncle Scrooge? I want to see the pretty Himalayan marmots. Oh, not this time, Willie darling. I need you here looking after the boys. Otherwise, who knows what kind of trouble they might get into. Oh, Best guardian smart. ever. Uncle Scrooge! Indulge me, lads. The last thing this expedition needs is a wee lass about. Oh, I'm going to have enough trouble looking after the launch pad. Good point. Nice plane. So yeah, best guardian ever, and uh, why are the Mighty Ducks going to be here? Launch pad. I told you to land in the center of the mountain range, not in the center of a mountain. <laughs> Gee, Mr. McD, I thought that crash was rock solid. The only rocks around here are the ones inside your head. Ugh, we're nowhere near Shadow Pass and the Lost Crown. Now fix this wreck so we can get airborne and step on it, lad. I'm paying you by the hour, and I'll may have you billing me for overtime. No problem, boss. As long as I have this fuel regulator, we're as good as... Whoopsie-daisy. Oops. <laughs> uh, my mom always said I was a Butterfingers. <laughs> oh, no. Please tell me you've got another one of those. Sure I do, <laughs> but it's back in Duckburg. Launch pad! Don't worry, Mr. McD. I'll climb down and get it. You'll do no such thing. I'll get it. You stay here and try not to cause any more damage. Okay. You're the boss. I don't see this working out. Oh, there's Webby. <laughs> you cannot pogo jump in the snow drifts, so don't try to do it. It'll, it'll end badly. Ooh, hello. Thank God I could get on top of that. Man, listen to that guitar shredding for this. Oh, good lord. Really, I really can't afford to be missing my hops here. The buck and doom. Go jump on me. Yay. Hey, can you get maybe get both there, Scrooge, my boy? <laughs> I don't know why. I've always been a sucker for goat noises making me laugh. I don't know if that means I'm a five-year-old or what it is, but it always makes me laugh. No! Oh, I need my $50,000 diamond. Oh! Brian! What is, what is this rope attached to? What possibly could that be? A, uh oh, that could have been could have been dangerous. At least here you have open area to play on, so you can kind of plan out what you're doing. <laughs> oh, that's that's kind of mean, Scrooge. That's between between saying Launchpad's dumb and making fun of poor Mrs. Beakley for being fat, you really are an awful employer. You know that. Now this was an invisible hole, I think, before, so... I've already been hit twice, good lord. Not doing too good. you small, got that right. Oh god, run! Probably not the smart thing to do. Oh god. Alright. Was there one up in this room? Yeah, there was. Now... No going back to the top now, so let's just get moving, I guess. Keep on collecting. Shablam! I don't know. I gotta tell you, some of what you've done so far has been pretty damn foolish. Well, that would be... Of course, the question is... 
Here now, don't touch that. I need it to fix my plane. Stop! Shit, well not, now they're never oh, gonna it's stop. too late. Those bunny bandits have torn it apart. I've got to find those pieces fast. I'm, I mean, the one that the one that probably, you know, ate the fuel. I'll have to wait till they run out of gas before they'll stop. <laughs> but seriously, it's not good they took that. Alright, we're down in the deep dang cavern of awfulness. Whoa! Hello, secret passage. This would be a hidden treasure. No, it's an extra life. That's not where the extra life was in uh, the old one. The old one, it was... Uh, The old one it was, I think, Brian, it was way down a corridor in the ice area that uh, you had to free Bubba to get it. So I'm very curious to see if they're going to keep Bubba in the game. Oh, God. Whoa. So we now have to take on the Mighty Ducks. That's cool. I know it's not the Mighty Ducks. Just bear with me. It really looks like the old Mighty Ducks logo, though. Yeah. Now, background's not going to hurt me. But the other one's mine. Hmm. Boom! Two minutes for being stupid, Stevie. That's what you get. What did I just get? Morning and glory! <laughs> now to find the other two pieces. So what, I got that for killing the, the bunny? Now this is where I'd probably fall down from the surface. I think maybe I should go back this way and see what I can find. I really appreciate him coming all the way up into the Himalayas to, uh, you know, to play some ice hockey. That really shows dedication. Oh shoot, I wasn't paying any attention. That was pretty dumb of me. Oh, good lord. I remember that being a problem as well. And also, why do they have spiders in the Himalayas? Do I want to know the answer to that? Probably not. Oh well, I wasted two hearts because I'm dumb. Uh oh. Wait, he's shining. Does that mean he's. What is he even shining? Am I just seeing things? No, I'm just seeing things. Excellent. Incidentally, this spot right here in the old game is where I had planned to do a submission to Twin Galaxies for trying for the highest money total. Because you just. You, you, you're able to kill the rabbit and jump back onto the rope, and then if it drops a diamond, you just jump back down and grab it, and if not, you climb up and come back down, and it respawns immediately. Okay, hurry up. Ah, really? Not enjoying some of the, the finer points of spider trolling here. Good, that's excellent. Come on now. Now, do one of you guys want to drop my preciousness of good... Oh, a one-up inside of that. That's pretty good. Oh, good. He dropped one. Nice. It's the second piece of the fuel regulator. One more piece to find and we can get out of this overgrown icebox. Indeed we can, Scrooge, my boy. Indeed we can. He's not actually my boy at all. My boy! You know, that whole rigmarole. Anything? Whoa! That's not cool. This is getting kind of dangerous. Now that's what I call a ruby. Now this is where we might find Bubba, because this looks like the area. That works. No, maybe not. Alright, that kind of works out. Can I hit... Oh. Can I hit these to break them? Doesn't look like it, so I'm not sure how supposed to even get through it. There's Bubba. Cuts me, kilts. It's Bubba Duck. Looks like that poor little pea brain got caught in a deep freeze. What was he doing here is the bigger question, but... Whoa, what happened? Scrooge! Ooga Ooga! Scrooge saved Baba! There, there, little fella. Uncle Scrooge is here to help. Scrooge saved Baba! Scrooge saved Baba! Scrooge saved Baba! Baba helps Scrooge! Baba helps Scrooge forever! You know, I could use a bit of help smashing away this giant ice box. What do you say, Bubba? Ooga, ooga! In that case, follow me, lad. Alright, so you're gonna break that for me? I've never seen a 
So this is what he's doing. See, before he used the one that I released. Is he trying to hit that bunny? Is he trying to? Is he trying to club the damn bunny? What the hell's wrong with you, Bubba? But yeah, he was the one that unleashed the uh, extra health uh, things. So that's a little different. Oh, I gotta go fast before he smashes it away. Thank goodness for the small miracles, I guess. All right. Nope, Bubba. Anything in here? Yeah. Damn right. Ooh, two more diamonds. See if we can smash that rabbit in the face. No. Too bad for him. Get over here. Man, he's making us money like crazy. I love it. Okay, wait a minute, Bubba. No, Bubba, you little f This is the end of the line, Bubba. It's time for you to head to the surface. Bubba home with Scrooge? Aye. Launch pad is waiting to take you home to Duckburg. On your way now. Of course, this home's way in the past, because if I recall, he ended up traveling forward in time somehow and ending up in their care in an episode, if I recall. All right, that's too bad. That treasure's got to remain gone. It's only apparently, whoa! It's apparently just five hidden, uh, hidden treasures. That's all in one. It's not a big deal. Don't get too worried about it, guys. That's what I've heard, anyway. Any truth to the rumor? Who knows? We'll never know. <laughs> but seriously, it's not. Wait, is this the way to the end? If that's the case, then I'm gonna have to go all the way back to. Unless I get lucky and this guy's got the third piece of what I need. He does, thank goodness. So I'm gonna miss some of the level. Oh, look of the ducks! The last one! Now to get this fuel regulator back to launch pad. Yeah, that'll be the plan, won't it? Won't it, Scrooge, my boy? Won't it? That's like saying my boy now. God damn. God damn that stupid CDI Zelda. It's got my brain completely clufflerated. Let's go. Whoa, oh god, I thought I was coming down that rope and I was like freaking the frig out, man. Not good. Alright, so let's see. Let's see if we can travel back the way we were. It's not gonna be easy, though. No, oh, that's so far as. Alright, the ice isn't too bad, provided you don't move first. Wait, is this where I just came from? I don't remember now, to tell you the truth. Oh! I don't want to go down there in case I get stuck or something. Oh, that was dumb. I just took out... Okay, this is where we were before. So we've now caught up to where we were before. Okay. I'm going to make my way back over this way. If I find anything interesting on the way to where I was, I will be sure to let you know. Oh, that poor, poor guy. He just wanted to play hockey. Just a good old Canadian lad in the Himalayas. Anyway. Okay, so we just went up that rope and we ended up here. This is different looking than it was. Nothing? Alright. That was really dumb, Brian. What were you thinking? You just threw away a life for 12 grand and you didn't even get the money. Wow. I don't even know how to describe how stupid that was. Now, can I bounce on Mr. Spider? I can. Excellent. Now, is this just here so I can pop this guy? If I'm not an idiot, that's where I can do it. Okay. I kind of forgot about the ice block right in front of it, but again, the physics are a little strange. I wonder if that's a death pit or not. It could be, but I have no idea if it is, so I ain't gonna risk, risk it one way or the other. And this is definitely like the other area, so that, if that's true, it means we can probably use him as a booster to go over the top. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Another one-up. Wow, they give you a lot of one-ups in this level. I'm not complaining. I'm just observing. Good enough. I guess I could have boosted up on top of that. There probably would have been something on top of that. But oh well. 
Anything? Anything? So far, this money total seems really low compared to the other levels. Of course, there could be a lot more level yet. I'm just based that on the on the old one where this is like the home stretch. This may not be the home stretch. Oh, Brian, you silly ass bastard. Yeah. No! Yeah, I got it. I'm the best. I'm not even close to the best. Let's let's just get that straight right now. Right, manipulate him to where we want him. Destroy his ass, because we can. Look for a few more and see what we get on this side of the break. Alright, back to launch pad. Nice. And Baba. Where's Webby though? We didn't see her once. Who Here knows? There you go, launch pad. Good as new. Now get this bucket of bolts back in the sky. Just a tick, Mr. McD. If this ought to do it. He's gonna break it. There's Webby. Now there's your problem. <laughs> Webbergale, what in the world are you doing here? I wanted to see the pretty crown, Uncle Scrooge. Oh, great. Now I've got to babysit you and Launchpad. But I can help, Uncle Scrooge. You're not like the boys, are you? You don't think I'm just a worthless tag-along, do you? We're ready for liftoff, Mr. McD. Ah, uh, not a moment too soon. Strap in tight, Webby dear. He never answered the question. He totally thinks she's useless. Off we go. Nothing but blue skies ahead. Clear as a bell. Not a cloud in sight. Oh, this is going to end badly. Launch pad. Knock off that infernal chatter. Gee whiz. I was only trying to lighten the mood. If anything, we need to lighten the plane. Feels like she's lost maneuverability with all the, uh... Unexpected cargo we seem to have picked up. No worries, Mr. McD. I've got the coordinates for Shadow Pass locked in. We'll be there lickety split. More like lickety splat. <gasps> Clone gold. gold. Nice to see you, McDuck. Especially since you've led me right to the treasure. To whom do I owe my thanks? Your idiotic pilot? Or did you play it safe and let those two V ones fly the plane? You dusty cheat. Only you could sink so low. And at 15,000 feet, no less. Huh. Complain all you like. The lost crown of Genghis Khan will look right at home on my feathered noggin. Wouldn't you say, Scroogey? <laughs> That's what you think. You'll never beat us to Shadow Pass. So, the crown is in Shadow Pass, eh? Thanks for telling me. <laughs> Just shoot him. Launch pad. All right, we're going to stop right there. We'll see where this is going to go. This is definitely new. Uh, yeah, good to see Glomgold's getting a little more action than he did in the first game. Glomgold's a bastard. He deserves to die in a fire. Anyway, we'll see you guys next time.